hi youtube so today i'm going to show how i you know painted my helmet by myself at home so what we require is a helmet of course a masking tape a scissor and a spray paint so it totally depends on you what type of paint you want it is glossy or the matte i chose for matte uh, and i wanted a black helmet so i opted for a black matte finish you look at your helmet see what all areas you don't really don't want to be you know painted or get covered on painted and spoil the look of uh, your helmet so in my case i have tried to you know mask uh, all those rubber areas which are like uh, for the ventilation and all all those uh, buttons or whatever you call you know for those plastic areas especially the back light uh, which i have on my sole helmet i really don't want to you know screw that so i mask it properly so that the when i spray i don't you know uh, that doesn't get spoiled So here I am using this cutter to take out the you know extra masking tape which is where it is not required. So you need to identify those areas and then you know with the help of cutter. So that's how and that's where you need to be careful you know before painting it because you need to plan your paint properly. as always shake fell before the spray paint bottle so you know it gets proper pressure built up in the cane and uh, start applying the paint all over your helmet so whenever we plan such kind of diys at home uh, we should plan it properly and uh, should see to it that we doesn't spoil other stuff while completing our job so in my case when i am you know spraying my helmet i wanted to make sure that when i spray it doesn't spoil the surrounding areas so i'm doing it uh, at my balcony 
I have placed my helmet uh, on a stool and, almo- and I also have placed a newspaper on it so that you know the stool doesn't get spoiled by the spray paint. So this is how and it's easy to rotate the you know stool also so that I don't have to hold the helmet and you know turn it around to make uh, to apply the paint across it so it becomes quite easier then. So these are the small things which which we should you know, take care of and plan it properly so that it uh, uh, ultimately gives us the better result. after the paint job it looks pretty decent to me and uh, the matte finish has come out really good so I'm happy with the outcome of uh, whatever I have done you know tried for the first time at home uh, pretty much happy uh, happy and impressive thanks for watching guys I really appreciate if you like this video and subscribe to my channel Thank you so much.